Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again, or for the very first time, to the Farts and Crap Show. And uh, if this is your first time here, I do apologize. It's uh, it's Danjo here. I have been recording. A lot today and why don't I remember that area at all that is way too far there's no way to jump there's no way why, why would they even like you know I'm not gonna take a leap of faith moment right now because, um... That would be a mistake. There we go, still got the drain. I think you can also do that for enemies that are like... Yep, on ledges and shit. I want to get that vestige up there and this way and then aha but that is not where I lost all my haze so that's not what I want to do at this moment Thanks for taking that shot, Louie. Oh wait, yeah, 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 there's a bunch of branch branching paths uh, that way, and I don't want any of them at the moment. Because why can they see me around a corner? That's so weird. Maybe they have the same like ability to manipulate. No, oh, he's dead. Um. camera like I do. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna go the same way I did last time. Because I don't want to change a thing. And also this one. I want to make sure I get my haze back. Nope, I thought maybe. Dude, you 
have a lot more health than I uh, remembered. Neat. Also, where were you, Louie? You could have followed me. You could have came down here, you coward. It's like, hey, you look, you know. Look like you're taking care of it. It was fine. Okay, so we already went that way, figured out what that was. Uh, this is straight death. Okay, good. Good to know. Um, this one is not so straight death. It's pretty obvious what I'm gonna do, isn't it? Just gonna drain him from a distance, cause why not? Bam, bam. Crap, I'm going backwards now, aren't I? But I haven't gone this way yet, so it's fine. Who cares, really? Yeah, I've one hundred percent gone this way. I mean, not a hundo, hundo percent. Not a hundo percent, but like, you know, like a pretty good amount, like 50, uh, maybe like 70 ish, something, I don't know. Not a hundo. <laughs> the cat does not like that one. It's like, what the fuck are you doing? Hello. Hola. Well, hello. I jumped down. I did. I jumped. Hmm. Oh, but you know what I didn't do? A lot of shit. Right there. And if this smells like a trap to any of you, That's it's, there's good reason for that. You know, I thought that guy was gonna have a lot more health. Oh yay, a broadsword, which is not even a good weapon. Oh well. 
It doesn't matter. It's not the reason to come this way. It's those. Wait, is that the ledge from earlier? That is the ledge from earlier. Huh. Cool. Where am I now? Okay, that's to... Okay, I get back to where I was. It's a one-way ticket to Faso. Call it heavy something. Let's do this one, who cares? Regen inducer? Really? Let's... That was... That was just a tease, that's all it was. It was like, oh hey, here's the thing. That's not very nice. Alright. Okay, I get it. This is the way I'm supposed to do the thing. Then we'll get the jump attack on this guy. And then we'll take this guy out. And then we'll only have this guy left, who's the strongest one. Which is fine. Won't even matter. Got some queen iron. Two pieces. That's actually pretty good. Is that a... It's supposed to be a mammoth or something? No? Huh. Not sure what the deal is there. You're expected to pull your own weight when Vestige. Got it. That's the big reward. Oh. Oh shit. Not good enough. Ordinarily I would not do this kind of tiptoe on a thing. I'm very happy that I actually like walked backwards effectively in there and didn't walk off the edge. Hey, purify rod missile sirk. Really? It's just in a cave? There's... What the heck? How do we get back? Oh, there's a deer. Okay. Okay. That's 50% of the map. That's not bad. I mean, we're cruising cruising now um that's all of the important stuff though since I cleared out all the enemies basically um it's, it's pretty straightforward once you know just like Stick to the right. But yeah. It's not that it's tricky, because this part is actually, like, pretty tough if you don't approach it strategically. So the first guy is, like, around the corner, but there's also a guy around the left corner. Then there's one of those red guys up there, and one of the red guys down here. So yeah, it's not... What the hell? Isn't that... Oh, did he dodge? He jumped backwards? Oh, hello.
Oh. Oh, now you can... Maybe. You son of a bitch, I didn't even see you. I think that's kind of the worst part. About those dudes. Get down here. It's like I have all the buffs on, dude. Just come at me, bro. Okay, so that is the right way to go for like the rest of the level, but there's a checkpoint around here, so. Also, I wanted to go back real quick and make sure to grab. That. And. I don't remember what's down there, but I haven't gone that way yet, so. Isn't this the way it came from earlier? It was, okay. Okay, and that was death, and then this way was the other thing, which I already did. And this was... the Yeah, where I just came from. Which means that one is new and everywhere else has been explored. But I did not drop down here yet. I may have already been over. No, I did not. I have not been over here. This one, the Night Spear plus three, that's actually pretty good. I mean, it's a blood veil, so every time you get a blood veil or a piece of equipment, it's pretty good. And then some awake. So yeah, not bad. Not bad. Definitely worth it. Okay, I just wanted to see if there was anything. It's a pretty big lip on this ledge. What? Oh, because that's the bridge. Right, that's not a lip, that's a bridge. Okay, and one drop down. Run about mirror. Run about mirror. Walk on the uncomfortable looking dildo snake. No, I do remember which is which. This one is to the shortcut. This one is also a trap. But, because I know it's a trap. I can just do that. I know. Usually, I mean, if that guy gets the drop on you, it it hurts a lot. Yeah. Checkpoint mo effers. And and. You can believe it. That is a depth map. Louis, I swear, do not run in. Thank you. Run in, run in, in, run in, run in, in. There we go. I mean, if you have the drop on these guys, it's like way easier. I mean, I don't even have to fight all of them, because they're stupid. And they don't see me up here. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna do this. It's like, why not? I couldn't think of a reason. 
because I didn't go the other way anyway, and this is like completely optional. Uh, there's a chest over there, so I want to grab it, and there's like two big dudes, and of course neither of these guys are dead, so let's go ahead and whomp, and use one of those, and one of these. Hmm? Plague Doctor Mask won't help you now. Of course, the game already spoiled that he's not dead because it's like, oh, you want to lock onto him? Here's his health bar. Right, breaker plus three. It's a bayonet. But it's a plus three, so it's kind of worth it. But it's not. <laughs> anyway. It's fine. It's a weapon. Uh, so now I have to go this way. I really... Oh, you're back? I didn't know that guy responds. Huh. But he wasn't ready that time. That's weird. Um. You know, I don't have to, but I'm gonna level up a bunch. Because I can. That's a big difference. Level 25, jeez. Yep, let's do that. Mm hmm. Sword? Okay. These guys aren't gonna notice, right? They don't notice shit. path I can drop down to, which I think is worthwhile, if I remember correctly, which I don't know if I do or not. Um, but this is the next area, I think, yep. There's a checkpoint, we got some map info, and that is definitely a boss fight. think. I 
Yeah, definitely gonna do this first. Some awake, okay. Don't drop down any further because that would be bad. Oh no, my bayonet, I didn't get him. Just gonna say, like, where the fuck is Louie? Okay, I didn't come from that way. That's creepy, don't you? Um. Impact wave and the defensive one. Ow, dicks. Take care of the other one, and there's. Is that part of the comes around? I think it is. Condensed? Well, sure, it's small. Okay. I think that's part of the same path this goes to, maybe? Oh wait, no it's not. No, that's the ladder that I went up. The dude with the bayonet was standing right there. Okay, so I am supposed to drop down to the other part. Gotcha. Alright, so let's go ahead and do that. And there's the rotten missile. That's the entire map for this area? I want to say that's correct. What the hell is that item I didn't grab? Oh. Chocolate garlic flakes. Ew. It sounds gross. Why does that sound so gross? Wait, did I take these guys? Uh, no, because I didn't. Okay. Yeah, because they didn't. Um. I didn't rest at the at the missile. Yep, right before the fight. Cool. Alright, um... Can I get anything good? Flame weapon, that'd be pretty good. Oh, strength and dexterity up. Uh, I can get it to... Of course I could get Flashing Fang, and that's already the thing that I have equipped. Although I have everything else mastered. So that I have anyway. So I could switch to Prometheus. Which 
wouldn't mean a whole hell of a lot. Flame spike is pretty good, I guess. I'm trying to think of like anything else that I mean overdrive would be great. Numbing mark would be pretty good. I mean I guess as far as like being cost effective, probably Flame weapon and strength and dexterity up and switching to Prometheus is probably the best idea. I don't know if uh, the equip load thing might be a problem. So let's go ahead and find out. Uh, mobility is slow. Even with the Venus Claw, mobility is slow. Because I'm over encumbered. Kind of thought as much. So, Atlas it is, I guess, for a while. Or for the time being, who cares, right? I mean, I could switch to one-handed weapons. See, here's the thing. Early on in the game, uh, two-handed weapons are kind of just better by default for a couple of reasons. One of them is some of the skills that you can get that are very very helpful especially for staggering enemies which most enemies you can stagger uh, with a heavy weapon with a one-handed sword you can't really stagger enemies and you can't defend from as much damage either but with practice you can deal out more damage faster, potentially. And Prometheus is a great blood code for that. However, that is after you acquire uh, quite a few things that requires a lot of haze. And uh, I'm not about that right now. So let's go ahead and get that one thing that I was looking at. Yep, Flash and Fang, let's go ahead and learn that. And I can't max out proficiency. Okay. It's fine. It's a good it's a good move anyway. Um Let's give her a bloodshot. I'm not really using it. I don't need to. Oh. Blood madness, that's not the right one. Flashing Fang, there we go, which is probably better than Blow of Madness. Probably. Cooldown is longer. The require strength requirement is higher. It's probably like a third thing. You know, Tormenting Blast I feel like would be a good one for this. Tormenting Blast is better for crowd control, so... Venus Claw, that's the only other one that's lighter than this. Alright, uh... That's fine. We 
we've yeah, it's fine. We've time to do this. I don't remember if there's any fanfare for this one. Oh, there's a little bit, right? Very similar to Ava Unit 1, right? Especially that one shot from like the side of the face. I mean, come on. Oh, I'm glad that didn't hit, but seriously. Dick. Minions are actually kind of a problem. Oh shit, in case Louie gets that. Whoops. Oh, is he taking care of them now? Cool. I'm all about that. You son of a bitch, don't. Oh, okay. He's got more minions now. It's fine. Ow, dick. Better get me, and thank you, jeez. Damn it. Yeah, this would probably be a good time to switch to something faster. Cause I mean that range, man. That just that speed and that range. It's kind of a problem. Let's start with these two. That's I think he's just summoning a dude. I think now... Yeah, now he's actually like... Yeah. Haha, suck it. Ow. Shit. 
Gotcha. I thought I saw something. It's just the obvious, the obvious thing. been making some really good progress. Like I'm, I'm, ha I'm happy with this. So, where are you dragging us off to next? Oh, shut up, Yakimo. You love it. What? The blood vein here leads to the old city ruins. Huh? Wait. Hold on a second. Shouldn't it lead from the old city ruins? Singing. Hey, look at that. Oh wait, is this one of those times when I have to... I should really mute the cam share? No, we're good. Okay. Careful. It's the hunter. Is that woman his partner? your story is but let go of the woman now Where'd they go? What just happened? It's like, uh, guys, can, can we teleport? Is that something we can do? I... I don't think we can teleport. It wasn't supposed to be like this. Dark Seeker. Also, um, jamming that uh, spiky thing right, right in the middle of her chest and <laughs> getting all, I get all blue. That that's not, it's not figurative. It's, it's uh. Sure, they can't be taken out of context. It's like Journey. We need to go to Vagina Mountain. 
welcome to Vagina Mountain, Charlie. <laughs> All right, now this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Okay, okay, alright. <laughs> Woot, alright, ah, uh, man, that's, that got me again. There's, there's no missile here, really? Well, there's one right before the boss fight, so that's fine. Um... Hundred percent. I mean, that's they literally mean a hundred percent of the map. Like you mapped out the whole area. Good job. Um, wait, seriously? I didn't grab something way back there. What the hell was that? It's it's not important. It doesn't matter. Um, I'm like. Yeah. Basically 100% certain. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I know where that is. That's the, uh... Here, we'll just teleport there now. As long as that doesn't... Get rid of items and shit. I don't think it does. Right. It should be fast because it's in the same area, right? It should just be a couple seconds. Yep, there we go. Um, it was over here, and I probably have to take this guy out again, yep. And then it was over here. What did I, what did I miss? It's like, Louie, you can start attacking anytime there, bud. Oh, come on. It's like under the debris. That's... They've got me shitting me. Gotta be shitting me. Such a dumb way to die. Alright, gonna go back there and get my haze real quick. Because why would I do anything else besides that? It's not like I was about to end the episode or anything. I just gotta be a bit more careful about the ledge. Don't you... Oh my goodness. The knockback is, like, insane on these guys. Like, that was, like, almost ten feet. It's really only ten thousand? Now you got knocked out the ledge. Congrats. Well, I mean, I'm glad it was only 10,000, but... Still kind of lame, regardless of how you cut it. Erm... But with that, this area is completely done, I think. Yes. Yes. Ran into the hunter and the singing girl. And we got the vestiges, we beat the tyrant dude, whatever. Yeah, this area is completely, completely done. Except for one thing that I could 
do later and I don't really care to do. But I could, but I don't really care to, so. Uh, let's go ahead and teleport back to the home base because that's the next thing I need to do, I think. Or I could just go back to the Howling Pit and continue doing that, but... I'm not even sure that's... Oh, I need Mia. I don't remember why I need Mia, but you need Mia for some reason. I think it's just to trigger something in the story. Or maybe there's a good reason. I don't remember. I mean, you feel bad for the kid. Like her... I think it's her little brother. It's not a spoiler because I don't remember. And I think they stated... Yeah, I think so. I don't think it's her son. No. I think he calls her Big Sis, too. I, I'm pretty sure it's her little brother. Um, but yeah, in the next episode, uh, we are going to upgrade some stuff, uh, restore some more vestiges, invest, search for the siblings, investigate the Howling Pit. Okay. They even say siblings, yeah. Alright, so we're going to go back to the Howling Pit and find Mia and her brother and restore some vestiges uh, because now we can do that one. And D is the only one I don't have for Prometheus, it looks like. But... You can get one-handed sword mastery, which would be great. It's also very expensive, but it'd be great. Or I can get Blood Sacrifice and Vivification, which would also be pretty good. Uh, hunting Feast, is, that's after you get all the well, Prometheus Vestige 2 and 3, which I can do, and Hunter Vestige 2. Oh, sorry, that is... I'm looking at the wrong one. I do have Hunter Vestige 2. I don't have 3 because I don't have Part D, so I can't do that one. Uh, Dark Seeker though, and Atlas, and I still don't have Atlas Part D. Dying Fire, Stun Travers. Eh. Okay, so there's a few that I can grab, but none of them are that helpful right now. Um, and since I'm going to be going back to the Howling Pit, two handed weapon is probably still the way to go. Uh, so real quick, before any of that crap goes on, I'm going to upgrade blood the Blood Veil that I've been using, the Festive Thorn, um, because that will be better for drain attacks and gifts and all that sort of thing, and we have 23 pieces of Queen Iron now. Wow. Alright. I really gotta take a piss, so... Uh, and it's time anyway, because this is a long episode already. Cool. What do you want to upgrade? Uh, I'm going to upgrade my one-handed sword too because we can upgrade that twice, I believe. Or maybe one more time? No, because then it requires steel. Okay. No worries. Okay. Take care of that. Thanks, Rin. Thank you very much, Rin. It's very nice of you. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get going, guys. Thank you for stopping by. I really gotta use the bathroom. Really gotta piss. And we've gone over the the uh, target time by like 15 minutes now. So uh, have a beautiful day, everybody. Take care, as Rin and Eo both say. And, um, till next time.